Nigella Lawson lasts just two weeks being vegan as she doesn't see the point of cook Nigella Lawson has said that while she doesn't mind cutting down her meat intake, she won't be going vegan and can't see how a plant-based diet is better for you by Jamie Roberts 6 colon no 2, 25th of October 2021 update to 6 colon no 6, October 25th 2021. Comments Nigella Lawson has admitted she doesn't see the point in being vegan after she tried the lifestyle choice for two weeks. The TV cook, 61, admitted that while she likes vegetables and respects the views of those who eat a vegan diet, she won't be giving up meat again anytime soon. She stated that humans should eat meat as they have the teeth for meat and added that she doesn't feel ready to live a vegan lifestyle after craving eggs two weeks into her trial run. Nigella did however concede that she would be happy to cut down on her meat intake, but said she felt run down when she went vegan. Speaking to The Independent, the cook said she couldn't see how a plant-based diet is better for you. She said she is unsure how it can be better for you due to intensive factory making. As far as I'm concerned I want to eat proper food, and I don't want to lecture anyone because I feel, well, I cling to the thing that we have the teeth for meat and so it's natural for us to want to eat it. I know it's an argument that a lot of vegans disagree with. I respect that position but I feel that I'm not ready. The comments come after Nigella's fans weren't impressed by a dish she served up on social media. She had proudly took to Instagram to share a snap of her swine trotters with mashed potato and curly kale dinner, but her fans were not impressed and said they'd rather starve than eat her home-cooked meal. Alongside her post Nigella wrote, I know this hardly looks like my kind of cooking, but that's because it isn't. Along with my at Walter Butcher's order, I got a heavenly prey made, by at Pierre. Kaufman, no less, pig's trotter with proper French mash and Madeira gravy, oh, okay then, shoo. All I did is steam and slice the trotter, and warm up the mash and shoo. The Cavolo Nero is my own little contribution. Different for me, but richly delish. One fan commented, the one thing my mother always said there's not one part of a pig goes to waste you can eat every part of them. I draw the line at feet and tails. Another wrote, I'm sorry Nigella, but that's the one thing I can't abide by that I know you love. Bloody pig's feet. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at webcelebs at Trinidamirror. Come or call us direct 207 Follow Mirror Facebook Twitter comment.